If you're looking for ways to minimize trauma during childbirth, then make sure you watch today's video on how to do perineal massage. Hi, I'm Dr. Brenda Heineke and I'm a pelvic floor physical therapist. If you're new here, then make sure you subscribe to my channel where you're going to learn all of the great pelvic floor tips, safe exercises, and ways to live a healthy, active life that we share here. Diving into today's topic, perineal massage is really a way to help stretch and relax and release the superficial muscles to prepare for childbirth. So in order to do it, you want to have some help. This is a dilator, but we also use pelvic wands here at the clinic that are a little bit easier to use. Um, you can grab the link in the description if you wanna grab a pelvic wand for yourself. I like it much better, but you can also use a tampon applicator if it's sturdy enough or recruit help. But you are working on these superficial muscles here. So this is layer one, and you're just inserting about an inch, inch and a half. So. If you picture this as the face of a clock, you have three o'clock, six o'clock, nine o'clock. You wanna do the whole bottom half of the clock. Ignore the top half, you're just going to irritate the bladder. So again, three to nine, and you're working all of the points in between that. So if I'm gonna just take that off, pretend this is what I was just showing you. You're going to insert about an inch, like I said, and you're just applying gentle pressure down at those areas. So six o'clock, nine o'clock, um, and it's just a gentle enough that you might feel a stretch, slight discomfort, maybe even a little burning, but it should not be painful. If it is painful, then back off a little too much pressure probably. So again, you're just inserting and working that clock face these are the deeper muscles. So at our clinic, we actually do quite a bit of work in addition to perineal massage to help prep and to have um, less tearing, um, shorter pushing times, and better success rates of vaginal delivery. So if you're interested in that, then click the link below and check it out and see how we can maybe help you prepare more than just doing perineal massage because this just works the superficial muscles. So again, if you're trying this at home, make sure you use a lubricant as well so you're not pulling or shaping. And avoid any of the weird swooping motions that maybe you've seen elsewhere. Not a big fan of those. We teach just a sustained pressure for 30 to 60 seconds. So try it out. Let me know if you have any questions, drop them in the comments below, and I will see you on another video.